Hey what's up guys welcome to another video in which we are going to write python program to count the number of vowels in a string so guys basically there are five vowels which are a e i o u so guys these are certain characters which are termed as vowels now we are going to check how many vowels are present in a test string so as you can see we will count the number of vowels in a given string in python so guys let us check this with the help of python program in vs code i'll simply copy this test string over here so that we are going to use it in our example so guys over here first of all we will define the vowels as those characters which are a e i o u so guys these are the characters that i have placed over here inside the vowels variable and there are no spaces in between we are going to check each character inside this string whether it is present inside this vowels variable or not and then increment the count for that particular vowel so guys over here what we will do is our test string will be this is a test string or a sentence so now what we will be doing is we will create a dictionary having all the keys as the vowels it is a e i o u so over here i will name the dictionary as count it is equal to and then we will use open and close curly braces over here followed by dot and then we have something called as from keys over here so as you can see this is the from keys method that we can use in order to initialize a dictionary now guys it will take two parameters the very first parameter will be the vowels itself which will be treated as the keys for this dictionary so over here we will provide vowels and initially we will provide the value for all the vowels as zero so comma followed by zero over here so guys what exactly is happening over here is the count is a dictionary over here it is having all the vowels as the keys that is a e i o u are treated as the keys over here and the value for all these keys will be zero so guys let us check this we will simply print the value of this count variable over here so when we print the count variable let me just save this file now and try running this code so as you can see we are getting the keys that is a it is equal to zero then we have e it is again equal to zero then i o u so all these characters which are vowels are having the initial values as zero now guys what we will do is we will use the for loop and go through each character of this string over here and check whether each character is present inside this vowels and if it is present then we will increment the value of that particular vowel which we have encountered over here so guys before this print statement we will have the for loop for care in and then a string name it is str and then followed by colon and then guys we have to check if this character that is this variable if it is present inside this vowels string so over here if care in vowels so in this case that means that particular character is one of the vowels that is present inside this vowels variable so what we have to do is we have to increment the value of that particular key inside the count dictionary so over here we will say count of that care so over here we will be accessing the value by using the open and close square brackets and inside this we have to provide the care which is the key over here of the dictionary it is plus equal to one so guys whatever the value of that particular vowel is it will be just incremented by one since we have encountered that care which is present inside the vowels string so guys this is the way that we have incremented the value of the keys as well by using the for loop the entire string will be covered and ultimately we will have the count of each and every vowel that is present inside the string inside this count dictionary over here so guys let me just save this file now and try running this code once again so as you can see we have got the count of all the vowels so the vowel that is a it is equal to two number of times so if we count the number of a over here we have a over here is one we have the first occurrence of a over here and then the second occurrence of a over here and then there are no a characters and that is why we have got two over here what is the count of the vowel e so let us count that so we have e over here that is one and then we have e over here two then we have three and then four so four is the count of e what is the count of i it is three so let us count that we have i over here one two 
and then we have three over here so guys this is the way that all the vowels have been counted in this particular test string now guys what if we provide a e i o u that is all the vowels just once over here so we say a e i o u so basically all the vowels are present inside our test string over here let me just save this file now the count of all the vowels is one in this case so when we run this code once again as you can see we have got all the vowels count as one over here and that is how we can successfully count the number of vowels in any of the test string that we want so guys please make sure that you practice on your own so that on different inputs you get different outputs make sure that you like this video so that it reaches to more people and subscribe to this channel so that you get the notifications on upcoming videos as well the next video that we are going to talk about is python program to merge mails so stay tuned